But yeah, I've been enjoying it. And then Joust, this is interesting. Sometimes I feel like I'm good at it, and sometimes I feel like I'm absolutely awful. Well, you're about to see how bad I am at it. It was controversial. I mean, yeah, it was very different from, uh... Very different from what Shovel Knight has had to offer so far. But also, I'm not really sure it's ever been particularly mandatory. I mean, you had to do it to get through the first, um, like, to fight Black Knight and to get the Glide Wing, but I don't think after that you did really needed it. I would say I'm in the middle. I don't love it or I hate it. I'm not like, it's alright. Chester with his usual wares here. Never need to do Joustus. How do you get on the glide wing without doing Joustus then? Alright, so here's one of the one of the opponents. Interesting. I see, okay. I guess I guess they made it so that Joustus was entirely optional. Too bad I I can't have a card game like this and treat it as entirely optional. So here we are. Look at this wisp chest that Specty missed. He wasn't being very meticulous, was he? If you beat me at Joustus, I'll let you see the wisp up close. Ooh, who knows what'll happen? I hope no one gets hurt. Well, I'm probably gonna get hurt here. Okay, this is odd. We have. Four grids here. I'm going to put I'm gonna put you right here. Oh, the the, the middle is a graveyard. Okay, I just realized that. <laughs> uh I'm gonna put you there. That take over her card. Hey, come on. Uh, I should be able to take that right there. Jeez. Um, I don't think I can take that at all anymore now. Actually, I think they got that one. Particularly good at thinking that far ahead. <laughs> Alright, even if I go here, they, she can just push me to the right, so I'm not gonna move you yet. So these are triple arrows. Triple arrow, oh, the triple arrow that disappears after three turns of play. Ah. Uh oh. Interesting. Okay. I'm 
gonna go with that, because I think I might be able to push my frog into him and blow him up, right? Yeah. Alright, well I can't take that one now. And now they have all four! Uh, um, if I have something with a strong enough downward force, though, I can take two of these for myself. Oh, no, but you have the propeller thing, so I gotta do you. And now two of those are mine. Uh, I'm feeling like this is probably gonna end in a draw here. But I think this is gonna end in a draw. Draw. We'll have to try again. Let me edit my deck though, because I haven't added many cards to it lately. What, my deck? <laughs> it's been treating me pretty well. I have really not been putting a whole lot of thought into it, if I'm going to be honest with you. But I, I just work with what I've been get, what I've been handed for the most part. It has been working. I will say it has been working. I actually don't want you. I will take you. I don't know. I guess I'll add the Enchantress. Uh, what do I feel like? What, what direction do I feel like I've not got covered? I've got lots of ups. I got a good amount of downs. I don't have many left pushers, though, so let me get a left pusher. Try this again. See how many tries this takes me. Go right there. We're frozen. Because of course we are. Even Joustus is not immune from random freezes in this game, I swear. So I don't even really need that one. I can just go with this one. gonna lose its power soon. Not entirely sure what I want to put move on. I guess I'll do this. Oh, I definitely don't want to do that. Okay, this looks like it'll be interesting. <laughs> I 
the classical chiptune vibe of the theme. They have been enjoyable. They get you in the thinking mood. Alright, so Polar Knight should be able to go over there and take that one uh, on the left side. And he shouldn't be able to be pushed up and down without any more um, gems for them to take. So then, what's my next play here? I don't want to do that. I want to take something by pushing... But then I'm just going to get pushed to the right, so that's not the move to make. Definitely not that one either. I don't have a move here that I, that I am a fan of. So I guess I'll put Tinker Knight down here. Now if I do that... I shouldn't be able to be pushed, although I, my guy can be pushed right again. Okay. Alright, we're gonna push you to the right. I'm gonna do that. Okay, you're ready. Which way is Tinker Knight planning to go? Okay, well I don't want Tinker Knight to do that, so we're just gonna we're just gonna block Tinker Knight from moving. I can't push I suppose I could do that. That's not particularly secure. And then she, I'm just gonna get pushed down. That's, that's the problem. I need a card that can't be pushed right or down. The view. If I do this, you can't push me down or right. Okay, I should have that one now. I think I just want to take up a space. That should be secure there. Can't be pushed up, down, right, or left. And the Enchantress shouldn't be able to get pushed for a while, too. I think I did it. I think I gem I think I got a gem sweep too. Nailed it. Nice. Alright, well we're going to take the Dark Acolyte. And we're going to take Missy. And then... It doesn't really matter what else I take. I'll take you, and I'll take you. Nailed it! Alright, a deal's a deal. I'll open up the wish Wisp chest. Have a closer look. <laughs> Get it out of me! Uh, what in blue blazes was that thing? Weird. Becky said it sustained him. I wonder what it did to you. Well, I feel like I'm on drugs. I mean, I do like card games. I do. I've played my fair share of card games for sure.
Oh, I thought these were enemies. Formless and infinite are we, her legion of guards, the liquid samurai. Intruder, by our queen's orders, we settle our scores in joust this year. Without a table nearby, our battle cannot commence. That sounds like a personal problem. Well, there's a table. There's a table here now. Would you like to play now? There's a table up here, though. I might need to get him to land. Oh, hey. Oh, we got the Shovel Knight card. Look at that. The titular character himself, who I haven't seen in this campaign. And Shield Knight. Cool. Still your tongue. We guard the tower's entrance with full attention. I'm sure you do. I think I need him to like to land on. Oh, I went too soon. Try to chill out here. Today we taste victory at the House of Joustus. You challenge us for our queen! Next game. All right, we got a nice normal looking board for once. Let's see how weird his deck is. All right, well, first of all, go away. <laughs> uh, Gonna push you out of there too. And there goes, uh, <laughs> there goes Tinker Knight. Alright, uh, let's see. I will put nowhere. I can do that, and then I'm just gonna get pushed to the left. Like, there's, there's nothing I can do about that. So, what I'm instead going to do is I'm going to put you here. I'm gonna block that off. And now, if I do this, the only thing that can get me off is the Liquid Knight. Which I know he's holding on to that Liquid Knight card. That kind of scares me. Might have been a mistake to let him go there then. Nah, now I can't push him. That was a mistake. Only the Enchantress can take that from him now. So let's not make the same mistake. Ah, he secured it with the Enchantress. Okay. Um... With the with the liquid knight. Okay, so he secured that one. That one's that one's probably not going anywhere. Let's do that. All right. If I do that, I blow his card right up. take it from me. But that's not the move. I'm going to do this. If I do this... No, sorry. With him. I win. 
I didn't get a sweet, but I won it. So I will take it. And I will take... The Liquid Samurai card. Pleasure playing Joust is with you. There's another one here. Oh, hey! <gasps> oh, what was your name again? Horus? It was Horus. Few ever find this place, but you are among those few. This is our champion's perch, and I am the champion. Unfortunately for you, I cannot be challenged yet. You must defeat the others first. Oh, and I think I can see your rat rope from here. Feel free to jump down. You'll surely be safe. Alright. Horus is the champion. He's my champion. Alright, we need to find the last one. I think it was a uh, Red Skull, wasn't it? I have to figure out how to get to him, though. Oh, just like that. My beloved, my betrothed, my heart breaks for her red skull lies misplaced. Look, people misplace things all the time. It's not my fault. So can we play Jousis or what? Well, my heart grows cold, but shall we play cards to pass the time? To see her once more, if only. Ah, uh, Joustus, it is then. Uh, poor Red Skull, but we know he gets a happy ending. What is that card? What are these death cards? Wait a second. Oh, they can be played in the graveyard, okay. A Polar Knight there. And I get shoved right aside. You away. Alright, uh, next. Put you there. If I put you there, I should only be able to be pushed. Although he, he's gonna use that his his betrothed card to push me up, and then the only way, the only place he will be able to go is onto the gem. So I don't want to make that move yet. I need to I need to wait until he plays that card before I try and take that one. Uh, so then, what am I going to do? I guess I will try for... Actually, I could do this. No, well, it's the exact same problem. I'm just gonna put you here. Start making a play from the middle gem now. Interesting choice. Don't know why you went with that. So now I'm back to my, my option here. If I... If I put you here, the only direction I can go now is right, and you can't stop me. That middle gem is mine. Or that bottom gem is. I do like that. I do like that a lot. I'll take that. deck looks awful right now. Like, his hand, the cards he can play, he has, like, nothing. I don't have anything that I can push right. Now I do. Jump sweep. Now I can take his beloved from him once again. <laughs> I'll take Gaul as well. Then these are all kind of regular cards. 
Thank you for playing, Red Skull. It was fun. I don't know why you two were easier than Missy was. As I informed Spectre Knight, the, the card printing is going at full speed. We simply cannot keep up with demand. Alright, now we can go face off against Horus. See how badly this goes. You've defeated your rivals, I see. No small feat. You've persisted longer than most up here. Now we may finally have a proper match. Are you prepared? So ready. <laughs> it's time for you to accept your fate. I accept my fate as king. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, I'm going. Chrono Shock? Oh no, what is this? Oh, he just takes my turn from me? Okay. Oh, if I have to think about it, he takes my turn from me? Oh, that's some bullshit! <laughs> okay, fine. Well, we're gonna we're gonna be speedrunning this one then. Uh That, that means to compensate that he can't be that difficult. Like, that would be unfair if he was, so, like, stupidly difficult then. That. And now the horse card is mine. And now... I've got all... F oh, never mind. I just blasted mine off. Oh, there goes Polar Knight off and then Shem too. <laughs> I'm not thinking too clearly here. Um. Thanks for that. Appreciate it. I need something to stop you from pushing me. There we go. And now I need something to push me up. Something that won't take me over. You know what? I think I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna let him take it. I don't want to play anything right now. Uh... Yeah, I'll just shove you over. I need a card that can push... Uh, never mind. That's unfortunate. Uh... Oh, wait, I'll do this. And victory. <laughs> I mean, that was an interesting gimmick. I think that was fine. I'm gonna take Horus for sure. And I'm gonna—I'll take Flary. And I don't—I don't know. I'll take Lunkeroth. Despite all of my posturing, I've suffered defeat. How embarrassing. Dang. <laughs> Perhaps I'll journey along with you for a time. Some sunlight might do these old dry greaves some good. Alright, Horace, you're more than welcome to join. My man. I think I got all of the medals that were there. I'm so glad we have Horace along now. See ya. Is there a secret that I'm missing there? 